Good morning. Today we're here at Sam's Club. We're going to go in and check out some of the prices, some of the things you guys have asked about, and check the shelves. Let's get to it. Okay, since we come into Sam's Club here, it looks like they're bringing out the spring furniture. I say, I don't really know whether these are good deals or not. Nice, they have a fire right here. I assume that's what that's for. Hey, do they have a, is this for like a fire? How much is this? Whoa. My goodness. That's a little pricey. <laughs> so, uh, there were a lot of people asking us how to do the scan and go. So, we're going to show you how we do I that we today. we showed it already. We did, but we've had a lot more uh, viewers since then. So, we'll show it again. It's been a while. Okay, so the scan and go. We're going to show you how it works. So, should we just show as we scan products, I guess? Yeah, I guess. So you, <laughs> so you pull up the scanner on you your just phone. You open up your phone, the Sam's Club app, and you go to Scan and Go, um, and then it pulls it up that looks like this, like yeah. your barcode. Right. And then you scan, get it in there. Scan whatever you want. And if you want to buy this three hundred dollar grill, then you can. <laughs> yeah, take that or off. Or you can there. <laughs> hit empty cart and empty it. Right. <laughs> only do that if that was the only thing you scanned. <laughs> right. Yeah. So, I mean, it's pretty simple. They do offer some deals to the and Scan and Go members. And you can just check out on your... Yeah, there's some, like, extra savings you can get if you do the Scan and Go. Yeah. And then you just check out on your phone and just leave. And you don't have to wait in line. Yeah, you don't have to wait in line. That's the most awesome thing. So, I just came across this peanut brittle here. And we got a lot of great comments back around Thanksgiving about this peanut brittle. Wanted to show they do have it on sale. Uh, we saw the price. This that's funny. This uh, it was nine ninety eight, not that long ago, but twelve ninety eight is now the regular price. But they have a four dollar savings, so you can get it for eight ninety eight this week. It's a good deal. Not a big fan of peanut br brittle, but when I pointed this out the last time, we got a lot of great comments on it. So eight ninety eight this week. We are noticing some Christmas items on some clearance sales here. They got this flame. Flameless LED candles, $14.98. That's down from $22. And they have this collector's edition. Um, is this the clock? Yeah. Okay, this is the clock people were asking about. Here it is right here. It was $100 during Christmas. Now it is $74.98. That's a good deal. These clocks are awesome. Do you remember all these after Christmas sales last year? No, I don't remember these. I know I came not too long after Christmas. They do have some on their wrapping paper here. Uh, really good wrapping paper. This is Hallmark, 150 square feet on sale for $7. That's down from $10. Uh, and they have cards here. Different uh, Christmas cards, $8.98 down from $13.68. Good deal. Just found some cool ribbon over here, $4.48 down from $7.98. 50 yards. 50 yards, wow. And it's got the uh, little red trucks on it with the trees. Pretty cool. I remember last time we got a comment on the Members Mark pork rinds. These are good. They are good. We've had these before. They did go up to $6.38, though. Uh, it was $5.98, so a little bit of a price increase. Uh, these are delicious, though. And you get a huge thing of them. Good to see they got their Ritz crackers back in here. They were completely out of these the last time we were here. 18 stacks for $9.44. Uh, prices have gotten ridiculous on Ritz crackers in the grocery stores lately. Um, a little bit of a deal. These are smaller stacks than what you're going to get in like the five pack at Kroger. Um, but yeah, it's still, still a better deal. $9.44 for, I think it's three pounds. Yeah, three pounds. Three pounds, 13.65 ounces. It's a lot of Ritz crackers. One good deal, and we've had a lot of comments on it lately, are the 12 packs of premium crackers, the Nabisco premium saltines for $6.58. These were $5.98. It's been a while, um, but it's $6.58 now. Still a better price. These have gone up to $4.29. I've even seen these as high as $4.99 for a box of four packs. So this is a great deal. Um, yeah, I can't imagine even buying these anymore unless I got this kind of deal here. Because it's just too much in the stores now. 
I know I pointed this out the last time I was here, but we continue to get comments on the Nabisco Nilla wafers and how expensive they've gotten. They are $4.99 for a box of 11 ounces at Kroger. $7.18 here for two packs that equal out to 30 ounces. So that is two 15-ounce bags for $7.18. I mean, this is kind of a no-brainer. Hey, come here for a second. So do you remember when we got these the last time and they just did not taste good? Yeah. So I yeah. just just wanted you as proof. Uh, I love the blueberry muffins. $9.98 for a 20 count, which is an okay deal. It's not great, but we got these the last time we were here and they did not taste good. So I will not be buying the Hostess version. Intamins has gotten really expensive. Do they have, yeah, but they don't have, they the, don't have the blueberry, blueberry ones. Still, 1226. 1226. They used to be like $7. I know. $7.98 for this box is what it was when we bought them last year. When we Holy first, cow, we got, it was one of the first things we bought here when we first started shopping at Sam's Club. And I remember it went up to $10.98, but yeah, now it's up again. $12.26. Prices are getting ridiculous, guys, no matter where you go. But yeah, I just wanted to point this out about the blueberry muffins. I know we've gotten some comments on these uh, that you haven't been able to find them. They were gone from uh, Sam's Club at ours here for a while too, but I won't be buying these anymore. Combos have gone up too. They're $11.42 now a box. Now these are the smaller ones, the little small packs. You get 18 of them, but I remember last year, these were $9.98 also. That just to show you how much things have gone up, uh, even at Sam's Club here in over a year. Jess just pointed out a really great deal though, because they've gone up so high at like Meyer and Kroger. They don't, I don't even know, do, do they sell the boxes of these? I haven't seen the boxes. Yeah, I haven't seen the box. They'll, they'll sell like the, the really, yeah, the bags. But this is one and a half pounds of Grippos. If you don't know what Grippos is, it's a Cincinnati barbecue chip. Uh, it's really good. $6.48 here for a box. We bought a bag that was like, uh, it was a half pounder. And it was like four something. So this is a really good deal. You get one giant bag of Grippos here. These are really good. Here's another okay deal on Cheez-Its. Now these were $7.98 as well. $7.98 originally. They are now $8.64. We saw where they went up to a weird number like $8.18. A lot of prices are kind of weird at Sam's Club. It's whatever they can work out the contract for. But I did want to say these are two 24-ounce bags. So like the family size bags, you get two of them here for $8.64. One family size is over $5 in most places. So a little bit of a deal. Um, but yeah, more importantly, they're getting them back in. This is another item we saw kind of disappear for a while. It is December 29th, 2022. Almost catching up to the new year here. They have these 12 packs of little Valentine's Day hearts already out. Don't be fooled. These are not for pets. These are just cute pet photos on assorted chocolates. These are... $11.98. Now I could see these being a dollar at like a regular store. They should be cheaper here. 12 of them, a dollar a piece seems a bit much. So we've got a lot of comments on chicken wings. I assume people are going to be making a lot of chicken wings for the new year. Uh, we have seen some sales on them. Sam's Club, $2.48 a pound. Regular prices in places for chicken wings have been over $4 a pound. So $2.48, not too bad. Uh, we've got a lot of good comments on Members Mark too. plus the drumsticks, still $0.98 cents a pound. This has gone back down. We've had some comments at some, Sam Club, some, some Sam's Clubs where they've gone up, still $0.98 cents a pound here, and the uh, thighs are $1.28 a pound. We are starting to see a rise in prices on chicken breasts. Uh, not here at Sam's Club, though, $2.68, which is actually down from $2.98. A pound so that's good that's come down 30 cents they do have the boneless skinless george george's farmer's kit here for 388 a pound we've got nothing but great comments on these they do still have their hamburger here i believe this is the 88 12 88 lean doesn't have a price on it oh no this is the 90 percent. okay sometimes it, it fluctuates sometimes it'll be 90 percent. sometimes 88 percent uh really good hamburger right here still well, that says four eighty-three. A pound. Oh no, that's what it is. Four eighteen a pound. Four. Okay, that's actually gone up. It, it did go down to three ninety-eight a pound. Now I guess it's back up to four eighteen a pound. 
They do have the all-natural packs here of ground beef, 93% lean, no additives, product of the USA, freezer-ready packs. These are three packs, come out at $4.48 a pound. These are a pound each, $13.44 for these three right here. I don't feel like that's too bad of a price at all. We had seen where stew meat had gone up. It is $4.48 a pound now. It was $3.98 of 50 cents a pound. I mean, that's a pretty big price increase, especially for somewhere like Sam's Club. Uh, really good quality meat here, though, I will say that. I did want to point out that their strip steaks are still the same price. $9.98 a pound, but look at this, guys. Looks like the ribeyes have shot up $3 a pound more. This is the choice, right? Not the prime. Jeez. $13.98 a pound. That is... I, I don't know. That was one of my favorite deals here, but $13.98 a pound, yeah, that's too expensive. Okay, so what you grab here? There's been a major shortage on Tylenol, apparently, well, so... I had Tylenol, but it was getting ready to expire, and honestly, Tylenol has been helping me with my pain better than anything else. Um, so I figured I would try the Members Mark brand because it's basically the same. Yeah. There's 400 the metaphor. 400 capsules in here. It was 11.98 or 11 something. Yeah. The Tylenol brand had 2.90, and it was 18.50. Yeah. So might as well get that one. Like same that's thing. Crazy. It's the same stuff. Yep. I know. What the heck? And that's good. That'll last us like two years. <laughs> yeah, and it don't expire until 25, so we're good. Oh, good. Awesome. So I wanted to show off the awesome roast here that Sam's Club has. They're always good. Great quality here. Never find a bad one here at Sam's Club. However, the price did go up. It was $4.98 forever for the last year. Finally went up to $5.48 a pound. They do have it at Kroger this week for $4.98 a pound, but it doesn't look this good couple instant savings here on raw tray pack shrimp here five dollars off per package no limit and it is not part of the it'll say on there if it's a scan and go item uh which scan and go sometimes you'll save an extra dollar or something but yeah i don't see many of those here today i was a little disappointed the last time we were here i saw those everywhere they should offer the deals for everybody i you know it's like everybody pays for a membership here uh they do have the dungeness crab here five dollars off per package crab is pretty popular for the new year so i'm not too surprised that they have a boatload of it here okay so we wanted to come back and check out the water it does look like they have replenished all of their ice mountain spring water it's the one we get the most comments on so i always like to point it out it is six dollars and 64 cents now but you get 40 of them okay guys so it's starting to get ridiculous here at sam's club these were going up these have gone up so many times look at this now the 24 pack 20 ounce Gatorade, $16. Well, that's what it was last time, 16. No, it was $14.88. Mm -hmm. $14.88. That was up from $13.88. Now $15.68. $16.68, sorry. I mean, that is just crazy. 70 cents a piece now, which is still better than the grocery store, but for Sam's Club, this is getting way too high. I want to check the Coca Cola and Pepsi prices. Uh, Pepsi 36 packs are still $14.28. Coca-Cola, $16.88 for their products. I'll tell you, I mean, that is just crazy. That's way too much. So we're going to be getting this Gatorade Zero here. It comes with eight fruit punches, eight mixed berries, and eight grape. $13.28. Much better deal than the $16.68 of the Gatorade. And the Powerades, you know, we're trying to cut out a lot of sugar out of all of our drinks and stuff, so... Gonna try the Powerade Zero, see what we think. So somebody was asking about grits here. Thought I'd point out this deal. You get three big bags of the Quaker Quick Five Minute Grits here. Three packs, five pounds each for $8.48. That's a great deal. And they do have a 40 packet thing of the Maple and Brown Sugar Quaker, which is probably the most commented one that we get on the channel here. Everybody seems to like the Maple and Brown Sugar. Uh, $12.48 for a 40 count. Okay, guys. Well, it is starting to get real here. And this is what I was talking about the other day. Saying that, you know, sometimes we shouldn't worry too much about the price. Look at this. All this rice is gone. All of it. All the basmati, all the jasmine people were talking about. Uh, they All they have left, uh, the big bags anyway, are the 50 pounds of the long grain, 
white rice members mark. Now, it's a good deal, 50 pounds for 1925, but this could be gone in a matter of minutes. So if you're looking to stock up on some rice options and stuff, you definitely want to make sure that when you find it, you pick it up because it's empty. Somebody was asking about Maxwell House Keurig pods. They do have them in a hundred count here at Sam's Club. They're popular. They're really popular. People buy these up. As you can see, there's not many left. None above me either in the rafters. $36.28 for a hundred count of them. Also, they have the uh, Members Mark Organic Dark Roast here. Been getting comments on this. Uh, it's been a little while, but uh, it's the first time I've seen it here at our Sam's Club in a long time. $29.98 for a hundred count of these. Good to see they got those on. They also got their breakfast blend back in. $29.98 for this. This is a hundred count. I haven't had this, but we've gotten good reviews on it. I know the last time I was here, somebody asked how much the um, original donut shop Keurig cups were. Uh, $44.92. I mean, that's crazy how expensive this stuff has gotten. It is a hundred count. But, yeah, it's, I don't know. They've got their decaf Colombian Supreme back in. Now, this is an 80 count for $24.48. Gotten good comments on this and the original Colombian Supreme here. This one, though, is $29.98, but this is a 100 count. Good to see that they're getting their own brand back in here. We've seen where these have been very low. Now we always see the French roast here. So I don't know if it's as popular or not, but it is a hundred of them. And this one is $29.98. They also have the Mick Cafe here, which is 94. Guess they couldn't push it to a hundred, but it is $39.48 for this. Surprised they're selling as many of the Pike's Place with the price as much as it is. Now it's $41.98 for a 72 count. Now, you know, I like Pike's Place. I got this on sale not that long ago. Um, but yeah, they're selling it. None above me in the rafters either. It's all like paper plates and stuff. Folgers for the 100 pods here, $45.34. And they do have the Tim Hortons 100 count here, $42.64. This one's $45.34. This one is $42.64. Both have gone up. I thought when I first saw this with the Pike's Place that it was on sale. Nope, I guess they just got extra over here, $41.98. They do have the Donut Shop, members mark $29.98. This is okay. Uh, I remember I tried this a while back, did a little bit of a taste test on it. It's okay. It's not my favorite. You guys know I love Donut Shop coffees, but not my favorite here, but it's okay. It's real, it's smooth. Something else that you may want to stock up on when you have a chance or if you find it on sale, maybe if, even if it's not on sale, uh, the 40 ounce ground Pike's Place coffee, $21.93. Same goes for the French roast. Now they have the whole bean here, same price, 40 ounces for $21.93. They do have the donut shop blend, the members mark donut shop ground, 40 ounces for $10.86. And the Cafe Bastello, which we've been getting an outrageous amount of comments on uh, Cafe Bastello lately. Uh, not outrageous, but we've just been getting a lot, a lot of comments on it more than usual. Uh, $16.94 uh, for the festival size, the big festival size. That's a pretty good deal, all considering you're going to pay $17 for the party size at Kroger. So, and they do have the Folgers 28.8 ounce cans for $13.68. Believe it or not, that is a good deal these days. Also, again, I'll point out with the original Coffee Mate 56 ounce creamer, $6.98. You're going to pay $6.98 for one about half this size at Kroger. The same price. So you're getting double, pretty much double for the same price. No price changes in the Folgers Colombian, $14.46 for this. They do have this bourbon infused coffee that we got some good comments on, and it is on a clearance price. Regular price of this is $17.18, minus $4.27 additional savings, no, no uh, scan and go required, $12.91 for these. Got some good comments on this. Also, Dunkin' Donuts for the 72 pods is the same as Starbucks, $41.98. Um, I usually wait till I find this on sale before I buy any. 
over the last month or so, we've gotten a few comments that uh, some of the Sam's Clubs across the country have gone up in price when it comes to the toilet paper. Remember Smart Toilet Paper? $21.78 still here at ours. Some people are saying that it's about, I think, uh, close to 23 at yours. I'm going to go ahead and buy some. Uh, we don't really need it right now, but I'm just going to go ahead and buy an extra one because chances are by the time I get back here next time, this will probably go up in price. So good to this is why we love the channel here that's why we love doing what we do because you guys leave these things in the comments so that we know ahead of time what some of the prices are going up to so we know what to stock up on when we find the good deals as i was walking by here i did want to mention that they still have the power flex garbage bags 17 dollars 98 this is another one that people have been saying have been going up uh this is a great deal 200 these are good garbage bags We've been using them for a long time now. $17.98 for 200 bags. It's a great deal. And they're, it's great quality. So as I was walking by here, I did find the Folgers Classic Roast. Now this is the shrink-flated 43 and a half ounces, I believe. Yeah. 43 and a half ounces, $12.98. Yeah, it feels like these things keep going up in price. One that is on an amazing deal, though, right now is the Duncan Original Blend. Now this is 45 ounces, not like the one at Kroger or grocery stores that is 30 ounces. We saw at Kroger, theirs was $19.99 on sale down from $22.99. This is 45 ounces on sale for $19.68. So same price as the one at Kroger, but you get 15 more ounces. It's a great deal. They have this big center aisle full of tomato soup and cream of chicken. I will say it's not as good of a pack, not as good of a deal on the cream of chicken anymore. $8.98 brings us to $1.13 a piece. And on the tomato soup, $13.42 now brings these to $1.12 a piece. You're not saving really much from the grocery stores here. I don't know. This feels a little expensive nowadays for Sam's Club. Now, where you will save is on this big thing of Heinz ketchup here. If you're a Heinz ketchup lover like Jessica is, it's 114 ounces of, eight of uh, Heinz ketchup here for $8.98. One 38 ounce thing at Kroger is right about five dollars, and it's only going up. Ketchup seems like it's just going up, at least for Heinz ketchup, it's going up. So that's a pretty amazing deal. So, for mine and Jessica's little New Year's extravaganza, we are making Skyline Chili Dip, which we will show you guys probably in a video as we get closer. Did want to point out this is Cincinnati's famous Skyline Chili, it is delicious. We'll, we'll talk a little more about it later. But uh, $11.18 for a three pack. This is two and a half pounds, which is a good deal because these are $5 a box at Kroger. Some places are a little higher. So it's like we're buying an extra one for $1.18. We are walking by the frozen pizzas and I just noticed the three pizzas of all the DiGiorno's here went up a dollar. These were $13.98, $14.98 now up $12. It was $12.98 last year. So it's up $2 from last year. We get comments on DiGiorno pizza. So I just wanted to point this one out. So we've gotten a couple comments on cold coffee drinks. They have their Frappuccinos here of the Starbucks. Now these are kind of expensive, $21.98. It is 15 of them though, nine and a half ounce bottles. So, yeah, I guess, you know, I mean, these are like 3 or $4 if you buy it at a convenience store. It's maybe a little smaller than what you would get there. But, uh, yeah, somebody was asking about these, thought I'd point them out. Also, I know somebody was asking about the Aldi version. Have to check that out later. Not sure uh, how much those are. What'd you find? I was just saying, is this a good deal or not? What? The sharp cheddar cheese? Two. Two one pounds for seven eighty four. Uh, well, two pounds right now on sale at Kroger, six ninety nine. So no, it's not a good deal. I'll just get it from Kroger later. Had a couple comments on bacon. Thought I would check out. They have the Oscar Mayer bacon here, which you know uh, I'm kind of hit or miss with Oscar Mayer bacon. Um, it is three three pounds total, three one pound packages for fourteen ninety eight. The one deal I really wanted to show here is the right brand bacon. Now this is four pounds, four pounds of bacon, the right bacon here, right? Which is normally $18.98, uh, down to $16.98 here on sale. Uh, it's two, two pound packages of it for $16.98. That's a good deal. Uh, we've seen three pounds go for $17, so not bad. 
Also, we're always getting comments on Jibani yogurts. They have 16 of the 5.3 ounce cups here, $10.48. That is down from $13.98. It's a pretty good deal there. Hey guys, well, that was our trip to Sam's Club. You know, good things to stock up on, but prices are definitely going up at Sam's Club as well as everywhere else. Uh, we saw with some of the meat, a lot of the meat's gone up there. I can't believe the ribeyes have gone up $3 a pound. $3 a pound. $13.98 a pound. That is, that's way too much. That's crazy. But guys, I uh, hope you enjoyed our trip to Sam's Club today. With all that being said, we are out. And always remember, the adventure is out there.